G'day, yeah, g'day. Today we're reviewing the explosive world of the military. This private's being trained on how to use a hand grenade. The drill instructor's like, it's not a toy, mate. Just pull the pin and chuck the bloody thing as far away as possible. You want me to pull it? No, I can pull it. Too late. I pulled it. Throw it. Ditch it. Go, 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 go. That's the worst throw I've ever seen. Kaboom! I think the drill instructor should teach his men to throw tennis balls or tomatoes before giving them hand grenades. You know, war can drive any man insane. High five, headbutt. Who wants to fight a tree? Take that. The other bloke yells, ah, oh, that's nothing. A turn hot, hiya. Oh, the forest fights back. Treebeard fucking kicked his ass. He loves it. Marching is the foundation of any strong army. So is jazz choreography. Saucy kick, salute. Ah, oh, fix your hat, fix it. Keep going with the saucy kicks. Saucy kick five, saucy kick six, saucy kick seven. Here's a hostage rescue drill on a bus. It reminds me of that movie Swordfish, but with less gobbies going on at gunpoint. Okay, they've stopped the bus. In comes a bloke with a stick. Kaboom! Holy shitballs. What is the purpose of this exercise? Is the stick wanker okay? I think he is. He's on the right. He's standing up, slowly walking away. He's like, I don't know if the army is for me. I'm going home. Wowee, beware of the mighty boomstick. Tanks, fuck yes, tanks, the ultimate wartime vehicle. Unfortunately, they are cumbersome and difficult to drive onto trucks. Oh shit, there goes 10 million bucks in taxpayer money. This guy isn't a soldier, he's just one of them guys that's passionate about owning heavy artillery. Like this 82mm mortar cannon, nothing to worry about. I'm sure he's watched tutorials online. Oh, he's fucked it! Is he gonna run away? Is it gonna go kaboom? Nah, oh well. I'm sure he excels at Call of Duty. Let's see how the professionals do it. Lock, load, ready, fire! They fucked it too. They're running, though. They're definitely running. There's a pack of commandos. It looks like an industrial grade tyre is gonna go behind enemy lines. Tyre kicky activate! Commando neutralised! The tyre has infiltrated the base. I repeat, tyre in the base. Don't you laugh at me, war photographer, or you die. Seriously. No one follows up on war crimes these days. Meanwhile, over in Iran, spinny kick, that's one point to the ceramic vase. Crikey, it takes two blokes to hold it. Here we go, spinny, nah, nah, that is some fucking hardcore Persian pottery. On your feet, soldier, come on, remember your training. Remember what you learned from your dad's illegal VHS tape of Rambo. He blames the way the guy's holding it, the score is 3-0. Wait a sec, in comes a decorated mercenary to get the job done. Here yeah, no go! The generals heckle from the sideline. Chicka McConney, shah school! The elite mercenary thinks about doing a flippy move to stand up, but it's not the time. The show's over. One guy bows enthusiastically. War cry, and off to military court they go. This fella's relieved. That flower pot belongs to Auntie Fatty. She'd bloody kill him if he broke it, actually. Yeah, no, 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 no. The generals are like, maybe the army shouldn't be mandatory. We just never know what we're getting each year. Anyway, Hastam, should we go for lunch? Yep, yep. If you did not whack this one from the beginning or halfway through, whack it now. The like button.